I've got McKenny Clark alongside of me playing here in the first class championship with the West Indies Academy. McKenny, first of all, how are you doing today? Uh, I'm doing good, thank you. How about you? Uh, not too shabby. I don't need to get people asking me how I am, but thank <laughs> you for that. Um, so to get the nerves out of the way, right? I can take you away from cricket. Mm -hmm. And one thing I know that you enjoy is occasionally dancing. I don't know if you dance well or not, but <laughs> between you and Kevin Wickham, who's the better dancer? Uh, I have to give it to Kevin. You have to give it to Kevin? Yeah, I have to give it to Kevin. Is it because he's going to watch this or because you believe this? I believe it. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Let me bring you back to the cricket field. How have you been enjoying your time with the West Indies Academy? Uh, I must say it's a good bunch of players. I love the camaraderie within the team. Um, we just do what we have to do on the cricket field. Back each other 100% and enjoy it at the end of the day. Yeah, and you've been with them for, for some time now. What do you say that you've learnt since being a part of the academy setup? Um, I would say patience in terms of red ball skills, um, being patient for longer, field setting, um, learn, learn, like learning from the captain, Naeem was being around the world playing some cricket, so learning different things in terms of white ball and red ball from him, yeah. So you said patience, that means that you were impatient before? Uh, just always want to get wickets. <laughs> <laughs> no problem, but you talked about white, um, red ball, I want to take you to the white ball side of things. I had a little ear in my throat, forgive me. <laughs> um, but I want to take you to things like the CPL and things like the ILT20 now. Um, for CPL, what was that experience like for you, especially like getting your cap and playing with St. Lucia franchise? Uh, it was really great. i uh, really grateful for the opportunity from St. Lucia. Um, it's good to be playing home for your first CPL. Uh, we had a little more comfort. The likes of Darren Sammy, head coach, Floyd Reefer, assistant coach. So a little more comfort, less nerves. Because you know you have people backing you and believing in you all the time. You had a chance to even travel much further. You went across to Abu Dhabi. What was that experience like for you? Just being, you know, amongst those type of names and in that type of a setup. Um, for me, it was the quality of the, of the guys. Um, just being, coming to the game, doing what you have to do, get done, do your job, and be persistent with it. Um, I was there with Bravo, Polly, Pooh. Just learn from them, playing at the highest level international cricket field setting, the ball, different balls, your variation. And one thing Bravo always told me in white ball, I always get your yoker right. That's the best ball to go in a white ball game. So that's something I learned, executed that well. So good for me. No problem. And finally, back to the personal side of things for you. What do you enjoy most about cricket? Um, to be honest, just playing as a team. Once my teammates are bubbly, as I always still can't run around the field, let's just make some noise and have fun and enjoy the game. That's it for me. No problem. Well, there you have it. And that's the end of our chat today. Still nervous? Nah. <laughs> there we go. But yeah, that's a wrap for today.